is going on, fellow gamers? It's your boy, Fo, and I'm back at you with a video. Now, I've been really busy. The wife been sneaking around the desk. She's been tossing up roadblocks in the guise of holiday preparation. So things have been going a little crazy around here. But I promise you, the war rig video is coming up. I'm working at it. There's a lot of stuff. I actually had to build a couple of more things before I actually got painting on this bad boy. So rest assured, part two to the war rig video is coming up. Now, what I'm doing here today is we're going to do another little Facebook shout outs. Because whenever I have a little bit of downtown, downtown, downtime, I'm always checking out the Facebook. I'm always jumping on there and seeing what awesome builds, getting ideas, getting inspiration from all of you guys on Facebook. And we're going to start this off with our boy Zeus. And what our boy Zeus did was he took a big fat monster truck tire and he stuck it on the back of his chassis and this thing looks fantastic he totally did it a really good job of getting that back monster truck tire on there he got the fenders bent around it that make the profile really cool he got that cool fender on there with the license plate loving this thing two bits and the paint job is super smooth super clean and i'm loving it that ram looks great perfect nice job then we got brian and he came up with a little team. He got two buggies, he has a car. And I love the color combinations. I love that red, I love the white. And I love the little accent of yellow with that windshield. That windshield really pops, it looks super good. That engine looks really cool. And I love the weapon loadouts on these. And it's a cool theme to have the playing cards in the background. Great job, dude. Then you got your guy, Luke. And he came up with your typical pimp mobile. Whenever I see this chassis, man, I'm sorry. You know, you're just thinking pimp and it, it's purple and white right now. It's super cool. Great use of 40K bits. You blended it in really nice. It looks like it was meant for that car. I love the barbed wire. I love the, the uh, paint scheme it got going really grimy, really dirty, perfect for gas lands. Then you have this thing is when I first saw this, I was like, wow, this thing is fantastic. Um, just a lot of attention to detail, a lot of attention to the weathering. All that rust is great. All that dirt in the tires and the rim is all is all um, rusted up. It looks fantastic. Then you have, you know, the uh, tank in the back with the gas cans. This thing just looks like it spent a lot of time out in the wastelands. Look at the attention to detail with those shocks. Just perfect, man. Great job. Then you got our boy Ben, and he came up with a couple of cars where these paint jobs are just nice and clean, the weathering is good, and you just have a, like a really clean looking team going. I love the colors you got going with the blues and the reds and the yellows, but what I really like a lot about these cars is the uh, platforms, the bases where you kind of made them look like a highway. I'm loving that, so if I had to put a base on my cars, I would do something like that. That looks really good. Then you got our boy, Ed Raz, and he's like, I like a cop cars, very nice. And he got a bunch of cop cars going. They all look really good. I believe these are green light. They look like green light. They look like they're a little bit more detailed than your typical Matchbox car or your Hot Wheels. And they look fantastic. The weathering on these is spot on. The weapons look really great. All of the additions look fantastic. And the detail, is really high quality and it really paid off to use a little bit of a more high quality car than your typical matchbox car or your hot wheels it looks really great and you could tell the difference the weapons all fit in there perfectly i'm liking this theme a lot you know protect and serve now let's go you're gonna be on the new warden team buddy you're gonna go around put these guys in the paddy wagon ship them off and they're gonna be sentenced to race. I still can't get over that line, man. <laughs> then we got our guy, I hope I'm saying this right. Mas Bebe Saya is how I think it's pronounced. I don't know, I hope I'm not butchering your name, but know what, I'm not gonna butcher this review on this car, cause this thing screams heavy metal, baby. This thing screams wastelands. I'm loving this thing, this is an awesome, monster class truck this thing looks fantastic down from the weathering 
to all the spikes and bits. It just looks super cool. I mean, if I just put gas lands around it with some like filigree or like chain, this could be like the emblem or the cover art to like the um, next Gaslands expansion. Looks fantastic. Anyway, guys, thanks for sticking around. Talk to you guys soon. Fantastic.